great that they're doing it. It's it's going to be good to get some more females on board and, and get women realising that they can get into the industry and they can get out there and drive trucks and big machines and whatever they want to do. They've just got to give it a try. You, you're starting to slowly see more and more females out there driving trucks and, and big machines and stuff. And I think the more common it is, the better it is. It's, it's, everyone can get in and give it a go, so it's, it's good to see more females out there and it'd be good to get a couple more here as well. And yeah, it'd be good. What truck here do you want, mate? Uh, 23. All of the guys, team leaders, the guys that I work with, they've been great. They have been really welcoming, um, happy to teach me, happy to show me a trick or two, you know, train me and stuff and you know, give me some ideas and pointers and whatnot. So they've been really good. You see different people every day. Sometimes you might see that one person once a week and they come out and say hello or you know, they want to have a bit of a quick chat and, and whatnot and then you'll move on and there'll be a group of kids around the corner waving and getting you to do the air pump or whatever. Um, yeah, it's, that's pretty cool, that's pretty fun, so I like that part of it. It's, you're doing, seeing different people every day and you know, being out there in the community and they all wave and say good day, and like, oh, it's good. Any sort of training program for females or even males is, is great. The more people we can get trained up to do jobs is fantastic. It helps everything, it helps everyone. You're home on the weekends, so you get your family time at home and, and stuff. So, yeah, it's, there's a good work-life balance to it. Me, personally, I don't really think much of it. It's like I'm just there to do a job like they are, so I just get in and do my part.